in feng shui aspect, we can refer person's lifestyle. Some people will name the lifestyle as the life gua, ming gua, or personal gua number. You might be wondering why lifestyle is so important for that person. Lifestyle can reveal a lot of your details and others as well, just by knowing year of birth. For example, personal character, their luck in their career matter, or wealth opportunity and etc. To calculate your lifestyle is based on these two things, year of birth and gentle. This is an example for the lifestyle seven calculation for male Lucas. He born in 1984. And we add the last two number of the year of birth and bring it into single digit. So the number is 3. For male lifestyle calculation, we always use 10 minus. So now we use 10 minus 3, we got the number is 7, which means that Lucas' lifestyle number is 7. So now we do the female lifestyle calculation for Emery. Example, she born in 1983. And we add the last two number of the year of birth and bring it into single digit. And we got the number is 2. For female lifestyle calculation, we always use plus 5. We use the earlier of the calculation which is 2 plus 5. We got the number is 7. Now we know that Emery lifestyle is 7. I added this year of birth table as a lifestyle number 7 for your quick reference. For lifestyle number 7, their first positive trait is communicate. Because they are capable to articulate things during communication with others. As they are great at influencing and convincing others. Therefore, they are very good in diplomatic approach, especially during tough communication at work. They will reply in very tactful and skilled manner in handle sensitive or difficult situations. The second positive trait is attractive because lifestyle number seven, they have magnetic personality. They have a natural ability to attract and approach anyone else through their personality and their communication style. They are great in expressive and can articulate own thought persuasively, making own idea compelling and convincing. Beside that, they also kind of spiritual person. Naturally, they have deep connection with the spiritual side. They may practice meditation or explore more about metaphysic knowledge, such as astrology, Vedic, Feng Shui, or energy healing and etc. They also seek of truth for life such as wanted to know what is the meaning of life, what is the life purpose for them. For untrained or lack of self-awareness for lifestyle number 7, they tend to have this negative trait, jealous. Especially in relation to their achievements and relationship with others. Innate in deep inside, they are insecure as self-feeling is not enough. They like to compare themselves with others. They constantly measure on self-worth based on the external factor, materialized style that lead to feeling of scarcity or self-doubt. Egoistic would be the one of the negative traits for Lifestyle 7, as being self-centered by prioritizing own needs, wants, desire and interests over anyone else. They can ignore others via their actions which may impact others because they are insecure and fearful. Therefore, their defense mechanism is fenced off to protect themselves from emotional harm and rejection. So they are lack of empathy and will not understand others. The last negative trait is flattery. They tend to excessive and insincere praise to gain attention and also acceptance from others. Internally, they have strong needs for validation and approval from others. 
so they may have struggled to be own self to express their own opinion and feelings. So they rely on excessive compliments to mask own true intention to achieve their own desire or goal. I hope this video has been helpful for you. If you need a Chinese metaphysics consultation for a feng shui assessment of your home or office, do your personalized reading about your career, your wealth or your health, and you wanted to find out more detail about yourself or someone that you care about, do reach out to me via on TikTok, Facebook or YouTube to schedule a consultation. And do follow me for more tips and advice. And do forget, share this video for the someone that you care for benefit as well. Thanks for tuning in.